Mexico. Colourful. Noisy. This is Motorsport Central. The WRC is about to hit town and they're ready to party. Big crowds, breathless speeds in the thin air of the Sierras of Guanajuato. Smiles all round, and why not? And here's what lies ahead for Danny Sordo and the rest of the crews in Mexico. Rally headquarters in Leon, 400 kilometers northwest of Mexico City. From there, they'll tackle 21 stages and some 313 competitive kilometers of hot and dusty mountain tracks. It all gets underway on Thursday evening with a return to the popular Guanajuato street stage, taking them over the cobbles and through the tunnels of the famous silver mining town one of the most colourful, vibrant welcomes of the season in front of huge crowds. And then venturing onto gravel for the first time this year up in the mountains, Friday, familiar stages, Ortega, Las Minas, and starting with the now legendary El Chocolate, almost 32 kilometres taking them to the highest point of the season, more than 2,700 metres, thin air, twists and turns, fast sections, narrow roads, a tasty test in every sense. Saturday, more challenging roads in the mountains north and east of Leon. There's the famous El Brinco, another crowd magnet featuring a new spectacular head-turning jump this year. Otates is the longest of the day and indeed of the event, just over 32 kilometers. A double loop of three stages run twice before they return to the short spectator specials in Leon. They'll survive that two-day rough and ready roller coaster ride, and it's down to Sunday for three final tests. Still plenty to do, and little room for error as they tackle El Faro and Mesa Cuata, featuring a large chunk of the El Chocolate test before the end of rally shootout. The power stage back to Las Minas, just over 10 kilometers, with the drama often going right to the final few bends, as we've seen here before, of course. Get all the action, all live. Anywhere, anytime. WRC Plus, all live. <laughs>